how are you all finally you know it's a very it's a fantastic day for me because today i am going to do something really really that requires superpower and today i did require superpowers to be there in the session so it's going to be a fun session overall what do you all say it will because we are going to use marvel power today marvel power so we are going to be here with marvel power today so i hope you all understand that how much power do we require to score band 8 right 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 so that makes me a superhero isn't it that makes me a superhero so i am the leap superhero and do you also want to use these superpowers to score band 8 in reading how many of you want the super pass how many of you want the super pass if you do want i wanted to be there in the session today definitely wanted to be there in the session i didn't want to miss the session today so i had all my powers i brought them all together to be here wow so who is your favorite superhero who's your favorite superhero okay could be your dad so does he do something your husband your dad okay your father you know uh spider man yes spider man who is iron man perfect spider man iron man come on tell me how many of your captain america yes he is solution to everything okay good i hope he helps you with your ielts exams too because here i have superheroes sharuk khan kratos rocky bhai wow right fine so uh, uh i don't know uh, how many of you are fan of captain america captain america actor surya okay so actor surya is your superhero wow how many of you are marvel fans over here marvel anyone who's a marvel fan here right so you know when i was a child who was my superhero i don't know whether you can recall do you know who this person is i don't know i don't know if you all can do you know who this superhero was he man and the powers of the universe right yeah he's he man he man he man and the powers of the universe and his power lies it lies in his sword right so he gets the power from his sword and he is ready to fight all the evil in the world right so how are you going to fight your evils that is whatever your weaknesses for the exams are what is your how are you going to fight your evils you can fight with the help of your leap superhero right you can have you can do that with the help of your leap superhero who's your leap superhero so this is manisha angri and of course i am today posing as captain marvel yes today i have you you i'm posing as captain marvel today so today i'm going to be your leap superhero and what is my task today you know yes i'm not going to let your weaknesses overshadow your skills so we are going to find what your skills are standing and stick to your goals and facing the fear so today your captain marvel is here to help you solve all the questions through practice i'm going to overcome my mistakes in reading excellent excellent very well so you guys are all ready get up your swords are ready your weapons are all ready right so today you know what i have done i have invited a few superheroes to help you understand their skills right we have a few superheroes not all of them do we need all the powers in the universe or do we need the reading powers what power do you need do you need the all the power in the universe or do you need the reading power what do you need for your band 8 band 9 and reading so today's bonanza you know what is today's bonanza today's bonanza is that we shall need certain some marvel heroes and then we would also find what their skills are and we are going to combat our villains with the help of marvel powers what marvel powers are we going to use we are going to solve the questions right guys so high five tell give me a high five come on everyone give me a high five are you all in here to solve these questions So do you see how much energy i have all the energy that i bring for you all so are you all ready for the same yes are we there i am feast once again i am fist what super power do you need for ielts reading what super power do you need for ielts reading come on quick reading yes so quick reading you need speed and agility right understand what you read yes fast short reading yes skimming scanning and you need to concentrate because you need the ability to hunt and combat so which superhero is here to help us 
get speed and agility which superhero is here to help us captain marvel is there of course captain marvel is there but then you need to tell no of course captain marvel has it but we also have who we also have who who is this it is not difficult to solve it's just that we need a few powers and we are going to have them he's not batman yes yes bokunda forever and who is that yes we have a black panther who is known for his speed who is known for his agility he is known for it to his ability to hunt and combat so you need to know what you have to hunt for do you do you for in the passage you are asked a question and you need to hunt for that question so don't you need the ability to hunt and combat and then fight the question get the correct answer don't you need that just like black panther has it right so i am going to see i'm going to only ask a few questions questions who has the problem solving skill along with precision and accuracy so when i come to precision accuracy you are reminded of whom who 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 go on precision and accuracy yee who gives you precision and accuracy you need a hawk eye the hawk eye yes you need the hawk eye to have the precision so why do we need precision and accuracy why do we need his help to hit at the right spot absolutely aap koi bhi answer doge to chalega kya bolo कुछ भी आंसर दोगे तो चलेगा क्या यू राइट एनी थिंग एंड इज दैट राइट विल यू गेट करेक्ट यू राइट एनी थिंग डू यू गेट इट करेक्ट नो इट रिक्वायर्स प्रोसीजन इट रिक्वायर्स एक्यूरेसी सो यू शुड हैव दैट सो यू सॉल्व ऑल योर यू सॉल्व ऑल योर फोर्टी क्वेश्चन सिक्सटी मिनिट्स एंड एट द एंड ऑफ इट योर टेन क्वेश्चन टेन आंसर इन करेक्ट विल दैट वर्क for an 8 band or a 9 band tell me will that work for an 8 band or a 9 band guys yes no tell me tell me let me see see nahi chalega absolutely no so you have to be really really careful you need precision and what else do you know you require will power who has the will power come on i'm really 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 fan who watched this yes he does he does but here i of course every 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 super every superhero has the will power but you need only me yes but then you all need to be here in the class i am very sure you are going to understand that hal green lantern captain marvel whoever you want to talk about they all have the will power but one particular superhero that i am so interested in when it comes to will power is 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 doctor strange why why can you tell me why yes because his you know you know his fingers are wobbly you you know his fingers his hands were wobbly he could not do anything he could not write he could not pick up anything because of his hands but it was his will powers that allows him to move across universe right so don't we want that will power from Doctor Strange to help us cross our IELTS examination. Yes, so we need all of these superheroes to combat whom? To combat whom? Who do we have to combat? Come on, guys! Ah, yes, and who is that? And who is that? Who is that? Reading. Yes, IELTS exam. Reading our own Mister Ultron. Yes. whom we have to combat so that and you know what our uh, ultron is known as for does anyone know what is ultron superpower why is it difficult to combat he is super super genius and he can do things which can put the others into uh, into confusion as well right so here the trick is that ils is coming up with hidden answers and you need he emits radiation he puts you into the dilemma but we need to come out of that dilemma with the correct answers and all of these people are going to help us so it's like powers you need versus powers that will distract you okay so we need the powers that wo- that are, that is going to you know remove all our distractions is got everything from us. he da- he did he did so he got everything so how could iron man give it to all give it all to him we don't want that to happen right so we are going to 
to make sure that our distractors are gone and we have the power to combat everything, right? So are you now ready? Because I have something very special for coming for you all. Are you all ready? Yes, all my heroes, all my heroes. Okay, let's do one thing. Can you give yourself a name right now? Anyone that you can resonate with. Let's see that. Can you give me a name or you come up with a word that you can resonate with? Who you think is the person who's going to make you? Okay, Harvest. Yes, PK, Captain America. Horde. Okay, that's a name that you're giving to yourself today. Okay, that's a superhero quality you are going to bring up in today's work. Wonder Woman. Whoever is your Rocky Bhai, okay. Black Panther, Harvest, Spider-Man. Harvest, many Harvest fan, right? Black Adam, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, cool. Let's go further. So now we have a question and what we need to fill up the gap with, not too many words. You need to fill up the gap with only one word, okay? Only one word, right? That's how we are going to fill up the gap. Now, we have one question here. We're going to do the first question. Huxley formulated his theory while studying a dinosaur belonging to a group called so. So which group? So how would you first identify? My speed before I test my agility, I need to first figure out what I have to look for. So Huxley formulated. So we have to look for someone whose name is Huxley. And his theory while studying a dinosaur belonging to a group so what is the name name of the group that we have to look for come on the name of the group that we have to look for for the dinosaur so who has the answer come on so which line did you find the answer in come on i'll be a little precise and tell me which line the answer lies in it is in line fourth line from last so I have, yes, very well. Good job, guys. So here we are talking about Thomas Huxley. Huxley went to dinner and then he knew he was dealing with something. Two-legged dinosaur. Two-legged dinosaur. So Huxley was dealing with some kind of a dinosaur belonging to the classification known as theropods. Classification known as theropods. So what would be your answer here? I'm going to write everything in capital. So for me, it could be theropods. Is the, is the spelling correct, guys? Have I written the correct spelling? Wonderful. Yay. So down with one question. And here we are. Perfect. Right. So now tell me, what are we going to look for in the next question? Heel man rejected Huxley's theories because of the app apparent absence of dash in dinosaurs yes so we are going to look for the person hail man and then we are going to look for he rejected his theory huxley's theory because of the absence of dash in dinosaurs because of the absence of what absence of what so it's not there any parts of something okay fine let's go ahead right and check uh, here we are. Did you find it here? Do you find it here? Heel man, heel man. Where do we have heel man? Heel man. Where do we have? Heel man. Where do we have? Absence of bone. We, we need only one word, which heel man has noted that the two-legged meat-eating dinosaurs lagged. What did it have? It lagged collar bones so our answers would be collar bones and let's write it over here collar bones i'm going to write it here collar bones correct the third question right fiducia and martin believe that the ancestor of today's birds was a kind of early what we have fiducia here and we have larry martin here our two local opponents of the dinosaur theory they contend that birds evolved. Birds evolved. They believe that the ancestor of today's birds was a kind of early what? They evolved from unknown. They revolved from unknown what? They revolved from evolved from unknown reptile at a long time before dinosaurs. So what would be your answer? Your answer has to be reptile. Yes, your answer is reptile. Wonderful. Cool. Okay, next question. Similarities between them that count. So what counts? So evolution between, it cannot be evolution between the organism. It has to be similarities between the organisms, right? What about the last one? 
सो समाइम्स यू मे फील कि ये तो बहुत सिंपल है मुझे आ जाएगा और वही हम मार खा जाते हैं यू नो we lose our battle when we feel that it's very simple because what seems simple is not simple so that can lead to overconfidence at times and sometimes it can lead to i can do it attitude without a help and i guess it's not like that you require a help or a guide to help you understand what exactly it's all about every single answer has a worth every single answer has a word love vicious claw vicious is dangerous right vicious is dangerous so guys you all don't have precision you are not reading with precision vicious claw at the end of its wing so you need the word claw over here so the dangerous claw on a primitive word from madagascar you needed the word madagascar as well way to the dino bird dino bird argument the dino bird debate or the argument is here okay so if you read these two sentences you get the answer to this particular question wow wonderful so i believe that you all did a great job and have understood where you are all falling and where is your weakness thank you all for the wonderful being a wonderful audience and participating wonderful thank you good day bye bye